This is Rhonda Brooks with Farm Journal Media. Today we're near Quincy, Michigan with Missy Bauer, Farm Journal Associate Field Agronomist. Missy, what are we doing today? What we're doing today is setting up a tillage plot. In this field it's going to be a corn-on-corn -corn crop rotation and last fall this entire field was chisel plowed. And so what we're looking at doing today is coming in with different uh, leveling tools to try to make our first set of uh, passive leveling. One thing that we've always struggled with in this part of Michigan is leveling with any sort of a vertical tillage tool. Our traditional leveling tools are horizontal tillage tools such as a disc or a field cultivator. When we run those tools through the ground we know that we're putting what we'd call a density layer in there and those density layers uh, restrict some root growth. So what we're trying to do is test out some tools and put a plot out with these tools to take a look at if we can get a good leveling job done, a good seed bed while not having a uh, soil density layer uh, underneath. So today we have a turbo till as well as in the background there a Salford RTS uh, making our first leveling pass here today. In this field since it was chiseled last fall it is going to be a two pass program so we do know that we're going to have to come back in before planting and make one more pass with these vertical tillage tools. The other thing that we want to try to do is this is the first day of the plots being implemented. We're going to try to follow these plots throughout the growing season to make some evaluations in season of uh, crop growth, root growth, and then finally yield at the end of the season. So that's what we're going to try to accomplish here today in Quincy.